It's Leftovers, where I read the jokes we did not use this week. And just like Greg does it, this is my first time reading these, so here we go. <sighs> Donald Trump has announced a contest where the prize is a free dinner at his New Jersey golf course. Sounds good. Former Governor Chris Christie called it grandstanding. <laughs> then asked how many times you're allowed to enter the contest. <laughs> Too easy. Kim Kardashian has reached out to Tom Brady about buying a vacation home near his place in the Bahamas. In return, Brady asked Kim if she needed help deflating her ass. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. How that, how's that a leftover? <laughs> Gen Zers are upset at Howard Stern after a compilation of his lewd comments towards women went viral. The comments resurfaced when someone Googled the phrase Howard Stern. It's <laughs> <laughs> about right. New geological research warns that the height of skyscrapers is causing Manhattan to sink lower into the surrounding bodies of water, while some scientists blame other causes. <laughs> Pretty good. It's pretty good. Alec Baldwin became a grandfather uh, for the first time this week when his daughter Ireland gave birth to a baby girl. Friends and loved ones are predicting her first wor words will be don't and shoot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this week a 2.2 magnitude earthquake quake hit Yonkers, New York. According to reports, the quake caused thousands of dollars worth of improvements. <laughs> I live in Yonkers. You live, Tom lives in Yonkers. Is it true? No. <laughs> we'll get back to that. Christian Dior is paying Johnny Depp $20 million to remain as the face of its new cologne. Because if anyone knows the importance of smelling good, it's, it's the guy who shared a bed with Amber Heard. <laughs> just the facts, just the facts. Pilots for Southwest Airlines have voted overwhelmingly to go on strike later this year. Now, the vote was supposed to take place weeks ago, but got stuck in Phoenix. <laughs> The USDA is, banning, uh, is weighing a ban on chocolate milk for school lunches. They're concerned the added sugar makes it harder to pay attention in pornography class. <laughs> but it turns into, yep. And finally, scientists have discovered an ancient text that showed the first kiss in, his kiss in history it was recorded nearly 5,000 years ago. I remember it well, said the president. <laughs> Bravo.